guys, I'm going to show you how to bathe your hamster and some things you'll need. So first you'll need a towel, some sort of towel. You can get a big towel or two mini towels. And you'll need some type of brush. And if you don't have a small brush, you can use, you can use a paintbrush or a toothbrush that is clean. First you'll need it um, not too hot or not too cold. So um, I have mine, so now I'm going to hog up. It depends on how much or how big your hamster is, the amount of water you use. Make sure, um, well, I'm pretty sure all hamsters know how to swim as easily as dogs know how to swim. So, um, make it so that they can get wet still, but not make it too hot and too high. So, I have a Robodorf hamster, and now he's chewing his brush. So, I don't need much space for him. So, um, that's probably good amount. And if you want to do some, like a little fountain of water for them or something, a little fountain, you can do that. So, I'm going to show you how to bathe your hamster. So, first, you'll need to pick them up and then put them into the water. I let them swim around for a second. Let's let them get used to the water. Let them run over the one fountain. And as you tell, they will poop in the water, that's just fine. So then you'll pick your hamster up, put some water on them. I don't use soap for my hamster, um, but if you need to, you can use some sort of shampoo or conditioner for the hamster, and then let them swim around. But make sure you get that off really good. Make sure you get the water, get some water and rub it up on there. Don't get it in their eyes, but rub it up around there, on their face. Make sure it gets on their back and stuff. Make sure they're clean. Because, you know, how they live in their own filth. Get them wet in there. So, and then you just let them swim around in there for a little bit. And then what you need to do is just dry your hands off. And then what you do is you unfold your towel. here like I am folding my towel and then what you do is you get your hamster out and get mine out in a second and then get your hamster out set them in the t on the towel and then you wait a little bit until you brush your hamster mine's in here somewhere as you can see he's right there rubber hamsters are kind of harder to bathe because they're so energetic and they just like moving around and everything. But Siberian hamsters and long haired hamsters, kind of like that, they're more calm. So, he calms out, kind of dries himself up. So, put him in the middle and then you kind of cup some hands around him and then leave a little hole for him to pop out and it'll brush his hair and get him dry and everything. And then make sure you brush him. So, what I do is I hold him in my hand, I'll kind of Brush him out to get his fur straight and everything. He just keeps trying to pop out of my hands. So this is my hamster. Of course, after he's in the bath and everything. And they'll probably be dry in 10 minutes, I'd say. And so, I hope you guys like this video, and I'll be posting videos pretty much daily. So, I hope you guys like this video, and have a good day. Bye.